and you might say it's the calm before the carnival stretch run. All is quiet in downtown Mobile tonight, but that is about to change. You said it. Six straight days of rock and revelry beginning tomorrow. Fox 10 News Lee Peck enjoying the, the calm tonight. Lee, a lot of people taking it easy, right? Well, they are, Lanice and Byron, almost everyone. Some people uh, just hardcore like that. And fortunately for them, Mardi Gras only comes around one time a year. Take a look. The streets of the port city operating at a slower pace this Wednesday evening. And while it's a night off on the parade route, the excitement of the season still very much alive. Hey, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Happy Mardi Gras. Party, party, baby. As the birthplace of Mardi Gras gears up to go full throttle, Gary Williams and crew are here for it. New Orleans don't have nothing on us. It's a big small town. It's a big small town. It's a big small town. And this big small town attracting some big crowds. Really big beads of people have to touch them. They can't resist them. And while touching doesn't always turn to buying, Bienville Souvenir and Gifts tells us business has been good. Because it draws so many people from out of town um, and they come and they, they learn a little bit about the city and they look around here. And then for the local people, um, you know, it's kind of like old home week and people get to see friends and discuss and talk about the parades and it's yeah. just fun. With the Mystic Striper set to parade tomorrow night, all eyes are on the forecast. Well, it looks like the first part of the day will work out okay for us on our Thursday, but by lunchtime we'll start to see scattered cells developing in the area. We out, we enjoying it, and glad to be out and enjoying ourselves. Been so long. With the threat of rain, Roger Hill rethinking cruising down tomorrow. But if it's, it's real cold or raining, you won't see me. <laughs> Meanwhile, as we move closer to Fat Tuesday, there are 26 more parades on both sides of the bay. The MOT's always a crowd favorite. And the chaos of Joe Kane Sunday never disappoints. I'm a chicken. See me, you're gonna see wild and out on Joe Game Day. I promise you, right? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have me a brand new. I'm bought me a brand new toupee just for that day. And I have to tell you, we've also had so much fun riding on the Fox 10 Mardi Gras float. I rode last night. We're also set to ride Monday night with the Infant Mystics. We hope to see you out there live tonight from Mardi Gras Park, Leapak Fox 10 News.